Another day, another discussion about reforming the health insurance system. And this morning, Representative Steve Kagan held a listening session in Kiwani. The crowd was vocal, but not as hostile as those who attended similar sessions earlier in the week. Fox 11's Becca DeVries brings us multiple views on the health care proposal. Democratic Representative Steve Kagan has been holding health care listening sessions all week, and those attending have been doing plenty of talking. The government will set costs below the private industry. This is what's causing all the discussion. It's called H.R. 3200, America's Affordable Health Choices Act of 2009. Kagan says he's read the thousand-some pages. No one seems to know what's in the bill. Claude Bryant is still working on it. Taking time to under, because some of it is in very Subsection 3 of paragraph 2 of... From what he's read, Bryant says he has concerns about the possibility of fines for those who don't have what the government deems acceptable health care coverage and concerns about other provisions of the bill. We are going to be counseled on end of life. I'm going... Uh, why? Concerns range from the government's role in health care to the number of doctors available under the new plan and how it would be paid for. Others say the health care system simply doesn't need to be changed. Spend a day with me. Go spend a day with your doctor in their office and listen to those stories. They will break your heart. If we don't change our health care system and improve it, will become bankrupt. Kagan and some at the Kiwani session agree the country's health care system needs to change. You sit there and tell me we don't need a government program to help fill the gap where people can't afford insurance. I wish I could afford, afford your insurance. I dang wish it. That's all I have to say. While many weigh in on the health care debate, Claude Bryant shares his opinion and says he'll keep reading the complex bill. This is my future. My health care for my wife, health care for myself. We're talking life and death now. We're not talking money anymore. You, you, you got to get involved. Kagan says he'll take ideas from his constituents back to Washington to put in the bill. You can read all 1,000 plus pages of the health care bill by heading to fox11online.com and clicking on my story about Congressman Kagan's Kiwani listening session. By the way, I talked to a number of people at today's listening session. All of them told me they were not part of an organized effort to show up at the meeting. All but one person I spoke with was from the 8th Congressional District. That man who claimed to be a doctor was from Milwaukee.